this happens when I'm inventing little gadgets. When I really, really want to make it. When my will is strong enough, it's like there's a force helping me. Those seemingly impossible experiments all succeeded in the end. Many times, the successes couldn't be explained scientifically. I later chalked them up to... Mm, there's a saying. Uh, what was it? Where there's a will, there's a way. Oh, that sounds about right. Mind over matter, to put it simply. I've met all kinds of toys along the way, but when I met that nesting doll, I realized she is the most meticulously designed toy of all. Being meticulous is kind of a power in itself. The more meticulous, the stronger? That's not all! Huh? There's more to it? Compared to that, those little toys might not count for much. What Eve is most meticulous about, and what carries her deepest wish, is much more dramatic than this. upon this place by accident before. The factory boss's office. It's an ultra sincere and passionate wish that I don't even dare to think about. We've actually always been inside her creation. This entire factory is her creation! Has she been relying on her intense wish to support the toyification of the entire factory? Well, this place is huge! No wonder she's exhausted. Right, so she must be extremely weak right now. The way to make this place normal again is simple. Chief! Why is Chief coming apart again? I clearly just patched things up. Impressive! You've beaten the enemy even without Pepper! I've turned back! I've turned back to normal! Where am I? Uh, what year is it now? The commotion is coming from the workshop. What does this mean? We can leave now?
The door won't open! We're trapped! Monster! There's a monster in the depot! Let us out! This is my home. My family. All that I cherish. It can't be destroyed again. You're right! No one is allowed to do that! You'll help me, won't you? Of course! Give me your sorrow, and I'll give you power. Power that no one can stop. Give me. Give me. <laughs> <laughs>